What's up guys, my name is Ace, and today was meant to be a gun guide on the Mark 9 Bruin, the new LMG in Modern Warfare. I've done all my testing, I've got all the graphics ready to go, and I was all set to record. However, I ran into a bit of a problem. I can't get any gameplay for it right now, because this update completely broke the matchmaking system and the servers within this game. I can't get into a proper game at the moment. If I try searching in Ground War, it's been taking me roughly 10 minutes to get into a match, and every single match I've been getting into, it's been towards the end of the match while being spawn trapped by the other team. And the game's already basically over, so I can't do anything. And so I was thinking, you know what, I'll just stick through that match and it will get me in the beginning of a new match. Because that typically is how it works. But every single time I've tried this, I lose connection to the host once that game ends. And therefore I have to search again and I get into another game late after 10 minutes of searching. Now that's just in Ground War, I have been able to find a few matches of 6v6, but on almost every single one of them, it's not a full lobby, and for whatever reason, I don't get players on my team, but the enemy gets players on their team. And to top all of that off, with the strict skill-based matchmaking in its current state, while this LMG is good, it's not quite good enough to keep up with top-tier players using MP5s and M4s when I don't even get a full team for myself. So I toyed around with the idea of maybe just playing against bots for you guys, just because the main purpose of the gun guide is just to get the information out for you guys. But instead, I decided to pivot and just make this video because this is obviously a huge issue. I don't know if every single person is currently having this issue, but I have been surfing around on the internet on Reddit and Twitter, and it seems like this is a very, very widespread issue, and it's definitely deserving of a video. Additionally, on the Warzone side of things, as you guys can see in the gameplay here, the servers are also just broken here, at least for EU, at least the servers I'm getting on, I'm in Norway now. I can't find a single game where I'm not skipping and stuttering all over the place, and it's absolutely server side, it's not on my end because everybody I'm playing with is experiencing the same thing, people are just backing out of the games immediately, and I can't find a single good one. So it's just completely unplayable, which is really frustrating as a COD content creator. I can't play the game and have a reasonable experience at the moment. And to top all of this off, there has been no acknowledgement whatsoever by any official channels of these issues. That is, at least at the time of recording this video, nobody's mentioned like, hey, we're aware of these issues, we're working on it on the back end, and we're going to try and have a fix out as soon as possible. As far as the community is aware right now, they're completely oblivious to this happening. They have no idea what's going on because nobody's mentioned anything to us. But I guess there is one little silver lining. Yesterday, they did come out with a playlist update for Warzone that removed the most wanted contracts and replaced them with bounties. Bounties are back. This is great news. I just wish I could play the game right now and enjoy those bounties. Hopefully they manage to get this worked out soon so that we can actually play the game again. So yeah, that's kind of my mini rant for the day. Hopefully by tomorrow I'll have that gun guide up for you guys, even though I might just give up and use some bot gameplay just so I can get the information out for you. But I am curious to hear from you guys, have you been experiencing the same thing with extremely long matchmaking times or just not being able to get into a game, as well as really unplayably skippy lobbies within Warzone? And if so, I'm curious, especially with the Warzone side of things, are you guys experiencing this in North America or is this just something that we're seeing on the EU servers? Just let me know your experiences in the comment section below. That's pretty much it for today's really quick off-the-cuff video. I hope you enjoyed this one and I'll talk to you guys next time.